my Cuban rod. This came down from Ottawa. There's my little Canadian flag showing my colors as I ride the streets. Nice comfortable seat on it. This is a typical street, just kind of cruising around, quite lost. Lots of dogs. I'm going to try to make my way back. I'm not quite sure where I am at the moment. Not very good streets. Lots of paint here. There's a real shortage of paint in the city. Lots of flowers. Getting lots of strange looks. Probably because of the camera in my hand. Not too much English around here. Must be some sort of some sort of kindergarten, daycare center. Lots of lots of flowers, lots of lattice. It's a very common car around here. Lots of people out in the streets too. Just stop for a cerveza. Getting up to a main street here. Lots of decrepit buildings. This is actually a nicer area than a lot of places I've been in as far as uh, buildings go. Uh, now I have to figure where I am. Just on the same street, cruising along. Lots of big old places here. Lots of life. Lots of people around. Some sort of school, maybe. Not quite sure. Yeah, must be a school. A little park. A little fruit stand. Lots of garbage around here too. Uh, this street is uh, Fifth Avenue. This is actually one of the more busy streets in the city. And it looks kind of busy now, but there's really never much traffic on it. And there's a big boulevard in the middle for cycling. I'm going to continue down the sidewalk. The problem with cycling on these main streets is they use such crappy fuel in the local cars that the fumes uh, are totally overwhelming. Lots of smog here. I'll probably get back on the side streets here. They're a little more relaxing. The sidewalks here are a challenge to cycle on. This they're uh, they're so crappy. But even in the height of rush hour, this the street is more or less empty. This particular roundabout's a little different. People coming down Fifth Avenue have the right of way, and they can blow right through. It's the uh, presidential road, so they always get the right of way. But the first time you drive through in a car, it's crazy confusing. And just over yonder, there's an immigration facility where I was detained the other day. A little tip, if you're near Castro's place, always have ID on you. Otherwise, you're going to jail. I think the proper word is detained. Off the little seaside park to uh, chill out for a little while. Lots of crazy palm trees. 
Oh, there's a fellow cyclist. One thing you notice, no helmets. The only guys I've seen with helmets are uh, guys driving racing bikes. Lots of one-speed bikes. Lots of old cars. Not as many bicycles as you'd expect. Actually, it's a beautiful biking city. Big old banyan trees. Wild looking. There's what I like to see. Canadian flag. <laughs>